Um, this was a really interesting story. I'd never heard of this guy before. He's a he's got a sommelier something or another on a you know bunch of letters after his name, and um, he uh, put this wine together obviously in a winery in Spain in Catalonia, uh, which is in eastern Spain. Wow. Um, and Grenache Blanc, which is, as I said in the article, when I, I mean, all, in the last 10 years, Grenache Blanc has just exploded. I mean, it's just absolutely exploded. I, I am intrigued oh, by this so because good. it's Spanish, and it's Grenache Blanc, which is which is in the, typically grown in the south of France anyway, and that maybe even oh. close to the Spanish border. I'm not sure what part of where Catalonia is, I don't remember. Catalonia is, uh, you is know, well, Barcelona. Yeah, Barcelona, way northeast. Okay, so you can see that vineyard, you know, they picking up that bless you Ed thank you and then um, but to grow this grape there it just seems unusual to me you, you never I've never seen a Grenache Blanc Spanish Grenache Blanc I don't think I've ever seen one. Oh yeah no there's wines. there's tons of them they're, they're grown there a lot oh yeah. then that's right just credit me in front of everybody that's fine you know I mean I'll let it go this time that's what I'm here for you know <laughs> however this one is a complete departure from for instance our friend at uh, at uh, Babcock that was a Oh, it's Santa totally Barbara different. fruit bomb, yeah, and totally this different. is this totally lean, but all that fruit character in the middle, right? Oh, the fruit's still there. I think there's some great fruit in here, but it's got it's tighter, you know. I mean, because it's in a cooler, cooler Definitely climate. Tight. You know, it's interesting. Grenache Blanc. You go, oh well, you know, is that like Grenache, the red grape? Yeah. As a matter of fact, it's a it's a direct cousin of of, of Grenache Rouge. You know, as soon as I got to my nose, I got Mandarin. Yeah, exactly. Like a little lime. Mm -hmm. These are I love these wines. I absolutely love them. You know, nineteen ninety on the shelf is great price. Eleven ninety nine reorder the, price. Yeah, I'm at a ninety eight. I love well, this. I'm a ninety seven just from the experience of it because it's so interesting. Mm -hmm. That was really fun. I forgot that how good that was. I forgot it was Spanish. How can you forget such a stuff? Ed? I, you know, it's beyond me. 